Now the news, China plans to deploy a flying robot to search for water on the lunar south pole as a part of its uh, Chang'e 7 mission in next year. This marks another step forward in the nation's goal of landing humans on the moon in a span of five years. Chinese space experts have revealed the plans for the smart robotic flying detector, confirming that this lunar mission will play a pivotal role in laying the groundwork for a future research station on the moon. The Change E7 mission will consist of an orbiter, a lander, a lunar rover and the flying detector. Upon landing, the rover, lander and detector will work together to carry out the most detailed survey of the moon's south pole to date. According to a 2023 research paper by the China Academy of Space Technology and also the Institute of Spacecraft System Engineering, the six-legged flying detector is designed to climb, crawl, jump and fly using rocket propulsion, allowing it to explore rugged terrain, and deep craters beyond the reach of traditional wheeled rovers. According to the paper, the flying detector can travel dozens of kilometers in a single leap. Unlike conventional rovers, after arriving on the moon, the detector is expected to perform at least three powered leaps before switching to solar power for extended surface exploration. China's space agency has made huge strides in the recent past. Last year, the Change E7 lunar probe completed its mission to collect the first samples from the far side of the moon. In 2028, China plans to launch the Change E8 mission, which will work alongside Change E7 in a bid to establish an automated moon exploration network. And by 2030, China hopes to land its astronauts on the moon and build a base on the lunar surface.